While planning and building a solar PV farm, it is important to have an assessment plan to mitigate all the environmental and social risks involved. Let's see what some of the risks and inconveniences are and some possible solutions. A solar PV farm needs land and lots of it. Apart from land area for the panels, the farm also needs space for additional buildings, such as inverters and transformers. Even a small farm with a capacity of 5 megawatts, which is enough to power about 1,500 homes, will need 10 hectares of land. That's about the size of 18 football fields. If the project is far away from the main transmission lines, additional land must be acquired to establish the connection to the power grid. And especially during construction, access roads need to be upgraded or newly built. Even vast landscapes that appear to be sparsely populated have well-connected residents who need to be taken into consideration. Maintaining a strong social connection with local communities makes navigating problems along the way much easier and also is crucial for reputation building and maintaining trust. Nature can also take its toll. Desert landscapes can be prone to flooding, or there may be seasonal strong winds, which can compromise the structural integrity of a solar PV farm. Besides the correct choice of land and the connecting infrastructure, the site must offer amenities that aid the workers during construction. Some of the common risks are water scarcity, inequitable storage of toxic material, and occupational risks for the construction workers. This might seem like a lot of risks to take into consideration, but it's worth it. Considerate and sustainable planning ensures viable operation for years.